out here wildin', 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 like you wildin'. Get your money, sis, fuck the hater. Get your money, sis, get your weight up. Making money move, I ain't mad at you. Yeah, it's all about the clean and getting money, sis. Get your money, sis, fuck the hater. What's good, everybody? Welcome back to Two Cent Tuesdays with Jenny, where you will be getting my unsolicited, unapologetic opinion about what's going on in the world today. If you are new to this channel, welcome. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you are notified every single time that I post a new video. And you might as well go ahead and give this video a big old thumbs up. Without further ado, let's get right into today's topic everybody knows the host of mtv's wildin out show nick cannon also host of the mass singer used to be host of america's got talent used to be on all that had the hit movie drumline rapper <laughs> Okay. Tell me one of his songs in the comments right now. <laughs> no. Everybody knows the one and only Nick Cannon. We all know how talented Nick Cannon is and how Nick Cannon is always working and grinding and you see him on almost every other station. We also know that he was once married to the legendary Mariah Carey. Within that marriage, Mariah Carey gave birth to two beautiful twins, a boy and a girl twin. And unfortunately, the relationship did not work and they split. Eventually, Nick Cannon had two more children with Brittany Bell. I believe she's a model. They also did not work out. And then he recently just announced that he has another set of twins with Abby De La Rosa. And as of Father's Day, he just gave us another maternity photo shoot model, Alyssa Scott, showing her very much pregnant belly. He is expecting child number seven. He's had four children within the last year and a half by different women. Three. So, Let's talk about it, shall we? <laughs> it's interesting to see how close he is having them together with different women. So I'm asking you, my question to you is, what do you think about Nick Cannon having multiple children with multiple women in such a period of time? And I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys my two cents. I just want to know, what are you doing, Nick Cannon? Mr. Cannon, what are you trying to do? Are you trying to make your own football team? Are you trying to make a Tribe Called Quest? What is going on? Why are you getting all of these women pregnant? It takes two, but what are you doing, boo? You out here wildin', wildin', like you wildin'. Nick Cannon's sperm is running a marathon. They are tired. I mean, every woman you gotta be with, you gotta get pregnant. And I'm gonna tell y'all why I'm talking about this. Because I feel like other artists and other black men get such a bad reputation, such as Future and 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 the Little Dirks and and um, DMX, like. They're known DMX, who he take the crown. He has a lot of children. Um, and I feel like people often have so much to say about them. But how come nobody's seeing anything wrong with Nick Cannon doing it? Nick Cannon, I have to say, must have the, the golden pickle between his legs. Because I'm not understanding. I'm not understanding. I love Wild and Out. I think he is very talented at what he does 
not rapping, but everything else that he does, the hosting, the TV shows, all of that stuff, I think he is amazing at what he does. But for me personally, I think Nick Cannon is one of the corniest people in the entertainment business. You know how y'all got Safari, The Game, which I don't know how y'all see him as corny. Bow Wow, you know how y'all got that little list of the corny dudes? Nick Cannon is very high up there on there for me. But I respect him because he does what he got. He 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 hustles. He gets to the money. But he his his resume of women, I don't mean to say that, but he has had a good ass looking lineup. Like he's had, I mean, for cry, for crying out loud, he was married to Mariah Carey and got her pregnant. Christina Millions, Jessica White. Um, I forgot that other model chick. I mean, the women he's dealt with are beautiful women. So there must be something about that Mr. Cannon that took. <laughs> Maybe it is a cannon. It must be that these women are just getting pregnant by him left and right. Now, this is my issue with it, okay? I don't... First of all, within a year and a half, he has had four children. Four. Two with Brittany Bell and then the twins. And now this next one that is coming. For me, it's just like, now you're about to have project triplets, okay? Because clearly, Alyssa, she is very much do any day soon and her baby is going to be the same age as the twins that you just had i just feel like what are you trying to do because you're just planting seeds everywhere and even if he is a good father which i can see he clearly is and none of them chicks have come forward and said that he hasn't been a good father but how good of a father are you when you're spreading yourself so thin across these women like to me i value family that is something that so many black households miss out on and that's having a family a mother and a father both there for you so when i see somebody like him just getting women pregnant just because he wants so many children or whatever the case like i something about that just doesn't sit well with me because i feel like you are taking away first of all these women i mean i'm sure they're probably thinking they're gonna be his forever when they're with him in the moment but it's like you're leaving these women to be single moms and I don't care if you're financially taking care of them, you're, you, you spend time with the kids. At the end of the day, they're still considered to be single parents because you're not in a relationship with these women. And it almost feels like you're just smashing anything and getting them pregnant. Like, y'all don't wear condoms, y'all don't worry about STDs. I mean, like, come on, what is it? Like, I'm not understanding. To me, I feel like when people, when men like that who just have people like Future and, and, and all these rappers and th these different, and I hate to see our black kings doing it, but when I see men like that who just have multiple children with multiple women, to me, that man does not value family. Even though they might say, oh, nah, I'm going to be the best father to my kid. But you don't value family in a whole, like, to me. That's just, just again, this is two cents, two days with Jenny, so it's my opinion. You guys can feel a different way. But for me, if I get pregnant with someone, I want that to be my forever. I want my child to experience both mommy and daddy in the same household. Yes, we know sometimes things don't always work out that way. And, you know, things happen and unfortunately parents do divorce, split up, break up or whatever the case. But the way it's being done, it's like it's intent, like he's intentionally just getting these women pregnant because he just wants to have multiple. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's just be some good mm -mm, and nobody's thinking about the consequences after the fact. 
But I feel like now anybody dealing with him going forward, because I'm sure he ain't gonna be with this this last one for very long. Whoever deals with him going forward, it's like is, is this what you want for your kid? Because you know that's you know you know the procedure. You gonna date him? Y'all going? He gonna probably make you feel like y'all about to be forever. Get you pregnant and then it's on to the next. Like I don't understand what is the mission? What is the mission here? Because I feel like this is just not normal. Like this is not just like oh, we just we we a couple and we just had a baby because you know we are in love. Does something? It doesn't feel that way for me. For me, it feel like this is a, a, a plan or something. It's only been a year and a half and he already had four kids within a year and a half. Granted, um, two came at one time, but still. Nick Cannon, like, I don't know. I don't like that. I don't like that. I mean, I don't want to judge these women. If this, you know, for all we know, he could have the whole discussion with them. Like, you know, this is what I'm trying to do. If you down with it, then whatever. And some of them probably looking at it like, listen, it's a bag. Let me have this baby. At least I know my child will be set for life. But outside of the money, what are you really giving your kid? Most of us was raised by single moms. And you know that feeling despite even if it was even if it wasn't a financial struggle, it's it's not a good feeling when you don't have both parents growing up. Although I had sort of, but I see what not having two parents in one household can do to some children. Yes, some of us say we turned out already, right, yes, but I don't know. I just think it's weird. I don't know what his plan is. Like, what are you trying to do? Is this your whole mission now in life to just make as many as you can and hopefully one of them following your footsteps and continue your legacy, dare I say? Maybe to him. But I don't get it. Are all these girls from Wildin' Out, are they Wildin' Out models? Because every last one of them is like, oh, model so-and-so, model Britney Bell, model like, where are these models? Who, I, I mean, I'm not into the fashion world, so I don't really know who's, who's models anymore, but are these wilding out models that he's sleeping with and getting pregnant? I don't know. Like, I can't take it. Like somebody said, like, I'm starting to think that you are just the model for the maternity shoots. Like you can't possibly be having all of these kids. Like maybe he's just a stand in. I don't get it. I don't get it. <sighs> he's having all these kids. They're gonna have a whole TV show when they all old enough. I can see it now. They're gonna be the next cast of all that. If he can help it. I don't know. All I can say is God bless them. They're beautiful children. Children are beautiful. They're innocent. I don't mean to talk about your daddy, but I don't know. Continue doing right by them, Nick Cannon. But I just, something don't sit right about leaving these women as single mothers. Something about that just make me, something might make me itch a little bit. I don't know. But don't forget to let me know what y'all think about it in the comments down below. Make sure you follow me on all my social medias. Everything will be in the description down below. Thank you guys for watching as always. And Jenny is...